looking for their first points. And for Coach Shumawa, she's looking for some flow. The shot there from Thompson. on Saturday, but picked up some steam. Good drive here by Maria Routiers, the freshman from Spain. Don't mind seeing her throw that pump fake step in. Celia Carbonell from downtown and Fairleigh Dickinson with a one point lead. A bright start for FTU here tonight. This one's put up. Madison Stanley getting her first two points. Maybe coach for that. A big addition for this FDU squad. And they got to keep an eye on Stanley as she has now hit both of her previous shots and fairly Dickinson right up. Now from FDU in the defensive rotations. Francion drains it. And it's the largest lead here for the Knights. We said Francion. Hang on, three seconds. Stanley. Forces one, it goes in for three points. Madison Stanley and a 6 0 coming off the bench. How about that? That put up goes right in. It's now an 11 0 run and NJIT, they, they've got to make something happen quick. NJIT to get back into the game. Niles wide open for three and bang. Big make there for the sophomore out of Looking in towards Stanley. Tunstall matched up with their left hand, and Stanley made it look so easy. <laughs> Bell puts up a nice looking shot, and it's now a six point lead here for the Knights. For Bell, a guard. They missed a chance. The ball is loose. And Blankenship just gets it up to Bell. And how about Bell? Bell right now, she's Last in a game at halftime against Howard. They had two turnovers to start the second half. And Coach Shemua felt like that's where they lost control of the game. They were doing Strength here defensively. A contested shot there for Niles. And the bank goes in. Niles now, though five points may not be jumping Ooh. off the Kicking it out. Blankenship gets an open look and it spins around and goes in. Huge shot there from this. There is Francion and a long two pointer. Back to a one point lead here for Fairleigh Dickinson. How good has Francion been? It is. Elise Graham on the floor for the first time here tonight. And gets the pass into Francion and Francion with a nice move. That's a big time move from Francion. <laughs> Where they need to be defensively is Francion with the three, and it goes in! What a bounce there, but that high arc and shot, a soft touch. Now Terrace wide open. It makes NJIT pay. It is a 10 point lead here for Fairleigh Dickinson. She's for NJIT here in the fourth quarter. Here's Francion. She has been red hot. 13 points now, six of seven from the field. Inside Baish matched up with Francion, and she has just been a magnet to the hoop. And you gotta stay tight there with Francion. You have to be three shooting from the field here in the fourth quarter. And getting a look there was Elise Graham. Back to an eight point lead. And Graham getting her first minutes of the lead here in the final four minutes of the game. Graham, look, and right on cue. The senior out of Orange, Connecticut. That's why you put an upperclassman in. Madison Stanley. Francion, she planted her feet, and you talked about it. Can't give her that look, and she makes NJIT pay. 